glory, honor, and power to the one who reigns forever. Amen. Amen. Praise is honor and glory. Hello everybody, welcome back here again to my channel. How are you guys? You guys, happy, 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 happy birthday to me. Yes, today is 4th October, 4th October 2023. The Lord has been so faithful. He has been awesome. Lies, I'm going to share with you guys one of the favorite things I love doing on my birthday. Whether I'm going to, as long as I'm alive, I'm celebrating the day. Okay? I don't, it doesn't matter whether I am cutting a cake. It doesn't matter whether I am dressing up, I am taking care of myself, or I am partying. But this is one of the things, you know, we can't continue keeping some of the things like our spiritual life off social media. If we continue doing those things, you know, it's going to be like, at least there are so many people out there who do not learn. But when you share part of your life, your spiritual life, it also helps other people to know. And at least if all pastors and people are not coming on social media to preach or share testimonies, people will not get motivated or encouraged to actually trust in God or know that God does exist. Okay, so that's why I decided to share one of the things. Actually, today is my birthday. It's first of well, this is one of the first things I do. I dance, 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 dance. I sing, I worship God in all different type of languages that I know. How sao, Yorobanyo, Ibo. That is one of the most special things for me because it's not easy for God to bring me this far. Like, I have every reason to thank him. And I also go ahead to call my parents, yes. And they will pray for me because they say, there is a saying, it's not even a saying, it's just fact that the prayer of a parents, God answers it so fast, seriously. So they use this day, I call them, they will sing for me, happy birthday and all that. And then they will pray for me, decree and pass a word. Because you see, the prayer of parents, me, I don't joke with it personally. Yes, so so that is what I'm doing right now, saying amen to my parents. Okay. I, I want to go live stream, but laziness they catch me. Laziness, so laziness to go live stream. I want to go live stream on YouTube. As somebody that is celebrating birthday now, but I don't get the moral to go live stream on YouTube. What do I do right now? This is almost this is after three. It's almost getting to four, four o'clock. And I'm supposed to go live stream. But I'm, I'm just lying here. I don't feel like hmm, this is unlike me. See somebody where they do bed day today. But I'm happy. Uh any other celebration will I'll carry it. I'll carry it over. Tomorrow tomorrow uh, Senegal will be resuming school. Tomorrow is fifth of October. Every schools will be resuming fully. All the whole schools. So you know Senegal calendar and that of Nigeria is not the same. Nigeria has resumed school since September. This is October 4th. Tomorrow is 5th. That is when Senegal is resuming school. So you can imagine that. So every parent is now busy getting preparing their children for tomorrow. First day of school. And we, tomorrow is Thursday. Come on. We'll leave our own to uh, Monday. Monday will start officially. I just hear. Yeah, hopefully, I can start. I can go live. Let me just see. Let me rest smaller as well. More small. Maybe around five. I will go live stream. Just spend one hour. One hour. I'll drop them. If I can spend one hour, I'm not sure. I will just see you guys later. Anyways. Keep this one down. So it's some hours later I decided to, you know, order for a pizza. Uh did I even order bought a pizza for my kids so that they can have it. You see my kids, they love pizza. 
even they prefer pizza more than cake but i just ordered this one didn't arrive home directly arrived in our shop and they brought it back home for me so that's what i just want to use and give them may they use the whole body uh -huh, as their mother is with this ice cream as their mother said today is that by the you see they are finishing it the children love pizza eh okay that's just the update guys how are you how are you Eating pizza because of what? Why are you eating pizza? Because today is mommy's birthday. Yes. So guys, I decided to you know roast this corn as a Nigerian woman that I am. I want to roast this corn to my taste. You know, Senegalese people, they roast corn. Like I used to buy several roasted corn on the street. But it's not to my taste or my satisfaction. Because you see this light, making it is a war. I'm using nylon just to lighten up these charcoals. It's not easy. Like I've not seen where to get. I don't even have oh, kerosene or diesel or anything in the home. But that one is, by the way, I finally succeeded in making the light. So the reason why I decided to roast my own corn is that I want to roast it to my test. I'll gradually roast the corn instead of giving it a hot fire. Stand the way up. Senegalese people do, does, they will give it a hot fire that the corn will just uh, done fast, fast, fast. Why the inside is still fresh like doesn't it's not really sweet but when you do this one gradually you allow uh, the fire to heat it gradually and it gets done you will find out that this corn is very very delicious and very very sweet so that's why i decided this evening is either after seven me and my kids we are outside here roasting look at my first one i don't they eat too huh? i'm a lover of corn i don't think there's any other person that loves corn more than me please don't forget to like this video and continue to wish me well like keep saying a word of prayer for me i know so i don't post too much video about this baby <laughs> come and cut this cake with me now don't see the cake this one fine sweet past cake honestly ha i'm, I'm roasting it gradually ah, they come too sweet as i'm roasting and i'm eating as a nigerian woman that i am <laughs> see you guys <laughs>
I am not used to it. Even though they have tried several times to let me start taking that thing because they say that thing is good, especially for nursing mother. When I gave birth newly, one of my never did it. Like she purposely prepared it for me so that I would drink it so that I would have a lot of breast milk. Uh, unfortunately, I was unable to take that thing. Okay, so the woman said she did not get angry, but she really, you know, told me. Uh, that is to be good for my this thing that day she took the thing back home so when i noticed is the thing that they want to be i brought this small plate and give to the woman say oh, at first i said no but you know Senegal, they will keep insisting insisting their hospitality is touching us that you have to eat it you have to eat it like this country you know they reject food for these people handle i'm talking too much let me show you guys the thing i gave her this place she rejected this small place that i should bring a big bowl ha i reject so me and her started arguing arguing last last she went to use her hand bring big bowl to give me the thing <laughs> let me show you guys what she gave me my children and this thing this is what she gave me this thing they said is very very good for breastfeeding mother and this thing senegal people used to drink it every morning look at how it is and then it's very very hot as you're seeing it so eh? I'm, me and my children hasn't tested. Look at what is inside. There is one of these things. Like this, you'll be drinking it. Spoon, will you drink it? My daughter is shouting spoon, oh. But when I bring spoon now, she will not eat it. Because they haven't tested this thing before, even me. But this one she gave me, like, I don't know. God bless her, oh. Hmm. Come and eat, you guys. This one. No, 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 no. I think it's no, no, or something that they used to call it. Senegalese. This one, they take it every morning. This one is very, very good for the heart very sweet delicious i just thought of showing you guys see how hospitality senegal people i don't know if you guys can see the, the this thing just like cocoa just like it's it's form of if you're if you're if you're from northern part of nigeria or you have ever lived in northern part you know that cocoa cocoa there is one breast uh, cow milk that Hausa people used to sell and then they'll mix it with fried no no is exactly what this thing is that is just sweet I even test it because I grew up in Joss. And it's so delicious and sweet and good for mothers. This one is a good breast milk for any nursing mother. Okay, guys, I'll see you people later. Let me go and my daughter will looks like she will test it. Because they will see it. Oh. Don't think that I did not eat it. Oh. I ate it. <laughs> I ate it. It's just like cocoa. If you're just like cocoa, I've had three spoons now. I did and I'm eating it but it's much that is just my problem she gave me too much I didn't want her to give me too much I just wanted more of it um, it's well thank you Senegalese people now they try you you people like whenever they eat make on call everybody ah as an Ninja I be we know they for our blood <laughs> I would like to the share 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 it's good though this on our lifestyle anybody we're hungry they keep us no, hungry, no fiki somebody for this country because once you have Senegalese people around you, ah, they will definitely be giving you. <laughs> Anyways, guys, when I go outside, I'll show you guys what they are up to. They are still in cooking, 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 preparing. Oh, congratulations to the celebrants. Okay, on and do space. Ah, it's telling me no space. So, ah, what can we do in this content creation? Upon say, I don't delete, delete, delete video. If I upload for YouTube, I delete. I wish I need to buy USB so that I can be saving some of my content. Mm -hmm. mm. Take this in your I cannot go sleep this morning. I have a lot to do. <laughs>
want to name ball pepper ball pepper and all that so this one is, this one is my children's favorite and they're going to eat that one that one in the morning they did not eat it it's only me <laughs> that had that one okay guys so they are done cooking now they are sharing food and this is my own portion i know i went to help them small one yes even though they do not allow me to record them yeah they don't like videos so i have to respect their privacy okay yeah see you guys later hello guys welcome back so this is me after yesterday oh guys like i want to end this video but before i end them i have little sharp gist i want to tell you guys is it a gist so you guys know it was my birthday and i talked about birthday wishes if you watch my previous vlog and I not only talk about birthday wishes, I also prayed about it, but I just feel like sharing the birthday wish. Uh -huh. So on that day, 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 what did I do? <laughs> I did not do anything. I felt I, I behaved even worse than I used to do before. I lie down, I slept, I relaxed, although I did one of my first normal thing to pray and to worship God, to appreciate him for bringing me into this new year okay for adding another year to my years so where am i what is the essence my lesson why i want to talk about it is that you see in this life one ways to break barrier financial breakthrough is not all about praying now don't get me wrong final breaking financial break uh, break uh, breaking financial breakthrough so if you ask some people they will say is praying Praying is good, very, very good, very, very important. In fact, it's a, it's a must. But one of the ways, the most important thing that so many people fail to understand, that ways to break financial breakthrough is working hard. In fact, if you can multitask in any kind of work you do, if you can actually put in the air, do the air, have different type of source of income, that is the easy way to break financial to break financial barrier you know like you can't go and pray to god that you need some certain things and after praying you go inside and lie down how would that thing happen no we know that miracle no the tired jesus don't get me wrong we know that god does miracle yes i totally accept that i believe in that in fact i don't think there's any other person that believe in that more than me but at some point when you pray to god you have to walk you have to walk, labor for it. Even that same God was the one that wrote it in his word and said there is no food for a lazy man. So you can't just pray and go inside and relax. If you don't go outside, that helper will not see you. Because that helper will not come inside your house and knock on your door. Pam, pam, pam. And if you don't have anything doing, that your helper, the God cannot raise, cannot just throw money from heaven down to you. It's from what you are doing. What you're working from, that is where God will bless you. What I, I'm trying to share what's happened. I pray to God, I need such, I need this. I want to make a birthday party. I want to have a cake, cut a cake. But at some point, I was working towards it. At some point, I lose interest. I couldn't. I slept. I just slept and I relaxed throughout the whole day. Okay? So the essence of it here is whatever thing you need in life, whatever thing you want, if, if you pray, continue to pray and work towards it. If you have anything doing, come keep doing it diligently. You are selling, you have business, continue. Pray with, use your business as a prayer point. You have an office where you go every day, continue. But you say you go inside, go sleep. It doesn't work like that. So I hope you have been able to understand what I'm trying to say. Don't worry, as for my, uh, my pamper, the pamper I want to give myself concerning this, my 3-0,